Hi friends, welcome to the accountancy class. Today we are going to learn about the term issue of shares for consideration other than cash. In this topic, we are studying how a company can issue shares for consideration other than shares. Company can share issue shares at par or at a premium there are instances where a company enters into an agreement with the vendors from whom it has purchased assets thereby the latter agrees to accept the payment in the form of fully paid shares of the company issued to them no cash is received for such an issue shares these shares can be issued either at par or at premium and the number of shares to be issued will depend upon the price at which the shares are issued and the amount payable to the vendor in this situation first for solving this problem first we want to calculate the number of shares issued by the company for making the payment to the vendor the equation for calculating the number of shares equal to the amount payable to the vendor divided by issue price. The issue price may be at par or at premium. First case, when shares are issued at par, number of shares to be issued equals to the amount payable divided by issue price. First, we want to pass the journal entry for purchase of assets. The entry is Missionary account data to vendor's account being missionary purchased. The next entry, make the payment to vendor by issuing shares. Entry, vendor's account data, number of shares issued into issue price to share capital, number of shares issued into face value being shares issued for making the payment to the vendor. When shares are issued at premium, the number of shares equal to amount payable to the vendor divided by issue price. Here the issue price is face value plus premium. The important journal entries passed in the book of the company are first entry for making the purchase of asset entry asset account debtor to vendor's account. Second entry make the payment to the vendor by showing shares at premium the entry vendor's account debtor to share capital to securities premium the amount transferred to vendor equal to number of shares issued into issue price that is par value plus premium the amount transferred to share capital equal to number of shares issued into face value then the amount transferred to securities premium equal to number of shares issued into premium amount. B. Company make the payment by issuing shares at premium. Now we are going to solve one problem. Benson Limited purchased a machine worth Rs. 3,20,000 from H Limited. Payment was made as Rs. 50,000 in cash and remaining amount by issuing equity shares of face value of 100 each. Fully paid 10 issue price of 100 each. Journalize. For solving this problem, first step calculate the number of shares issued by the company. The amount payable divided by issue price. The amount payable is 3,20,000. Issue price equal to 100. So the number of shares issued equal to 3200 shares. Entry vendor's account at purchase account at to vendor's account 320,000. Second entry make the payment of a value of assets by issuing shares. Entry vendor's account at 320,000 to equity share capital 320,000. The amount transferred to vendor's account equal to number of shares issued into issue price. The amount transferred to share capital account equal to number of shares issued into face value of share 3200 into 100 each. 
being company make the payment to vendors